I praise and thank God for this beautiful morning that God has given us to come in his presence. For a meditation today let's turn to Psalms 121 verse 1 and 2. I will lift up mine eyes unto the hills from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord which made heaven and earth. Today we'll be meditating upon the eyes that are lifted unto the hills for help during the tiresome journey on this earth. Every man that travels through the wilderness of life's journey comes across different problems, different challenges till the very end. Whether it be a believer or an unbeliever, this life is filled with misery and problems. But the things that matters is that where does your eyes search for help? when you are surrounded by problems god has given man the wisdom and abilities that are necessary for him to live on this earth and man has made his life easy in many ways using his wisdom but very few who really love the truth can understand that man's wisdom can never give him the peace that his soul is searching for and the problems of this life are just a medium to know more about this life and the creator and when a person lifts his eyes unto the lord for help god through that opportunities opens the eyes of a person to see about eternity here the psalmist who seeks help in the midst of problems has the confidence that the lord who created the heavens and the earth will come forth and give him strength to move on the psalmist is looking unto the god of israel with confidence as he says he that keepeth israel shall neither slumber nor sleep we all know about the city of jerusalem which is situated upon the hills and the jews were proud of this city and the temple of god was also built on that hill top and this temple was the main source of their confidence that they were the chosen ones the temple the glory the law the prophecies and everything they received from the lord bears witness of the faithfulness of the lord and that helped them to strengthen their trust in the lord god presence of the temple in their midst that is upon the hills gave them the confidence that they have their lord in their midst unto whom they can call upon any time and now the psalmist is also seeking help with that same confidence in the time of trouble as a newborn child of god do we have the same confidence as the psalmist as we face different challenges in our life do we trust the holy spirit god who is dwelling in me to lead me in all truth do we trust the lord always like the psalmist who says with confidence that the lord who keeps him never sleeps nor slumbers many a times we forget the fact that god is with me and look unto men for guidance and help it is good to learn things from others but always remember god is my helper and my refuge and he is with me all the time even in the darkest moments of life when we were unable to see the path clearly let us trust the lord and call upon his name many a times the problems of life seem to be so heavy upon us that we are not able to raise our voice and call his name but if you lift your eyes with hope to the lord he who watches over you will come to help you and guide you So let us pray to the Lord to help us to look upon the Lord who is the creator of heaven and the earth and rest in peace. Let us not trust man or let us not put our trust on things of this world. May the Lord God help us for that. Let us close our eyes and let's pray. Father, we thank you and praise you for this beautiful morning. Thank you for your precious word. Thank you Lord for the hope that you have given us. All the children of Israel 
They lifted up their eyes unto the hills because they had their confidence in you. Lord, how blessed we are that you have made us your temple. You are there with us all the time. Help us to trust you. Though there are challenges, problems in our life, but you are there beside us all the time and you are holding our hands. Thank you, Lord. Help us to walk with that confidence. And may your name be glorified. In Jesus' most holy name we pray. Amen. May the Lord help each one of us to trust our Lord as we travel on this troublesome path which is full of challenges. But there is one who is there with us till our very end. May God bless us. The coming of our Lord is very near. Maranatha.